Welcome in at 6 o'clock tonight. A man is dead after a shooting in North Nashville. Metro Police say 44 year old Taryn Frazier ran up to homes trying to get help. Yeah, it was a gruesome scene there last night. We do want to warn you those these pictures may be disturbing. WSMV's Brendan Tierney talked with people who saw it all happen. Police say the man was shot twice here along Phillips Street and started banging on doors as he bled out. Danielle was home alone around nine last night when she heard someone outside calling for help. Scared and worried and just not really knowing what was going on. She didn't want to show her face on camera because police haven't made an arrest yet. Danielle says her dog started barking and she thought the man was trying to break into her house. So instead of looking through the people, she called 911. I wasn't really expecting it to be someone that was hurt. Danielle was shocked when police showed up and she found this pool of blood on her front porch. Just like broke my heart opening the door and just like seeing the handprints and just not really being able to to help, like just feeling guilty for not being able to help in the moment. There's obviously blood here on the sidewalk. Sean Higgum is from California. He had just gotten into town and was pulling up to his vacation rental when the man started banging on their car for help. When you show up and it's like, okay, it's a heck of a welcoming to Nashville. They found this trail of blood leading to where he collapsed. We were asking, you know, who shot you? He had given us a name. Police blocked off the entire area and searched for evidence. The man was taken to the hospital where he died. Danielle hired a cleaning crew to take care of the blood as she tries to figure out why the man spent five minutes at her house. I don't know if it's because we leave the porch light on or because the house is like yellow. In North Nashville, Brendan Tierney, WSMV4.